So this is part two of my video on how to set up streaming. If you want to see part one on how to enable it, just simply click on your screen now and it'll take you to that video. Hey guys, what is up? So, first step you're going to want to do is go to the login to your channel and go to your video manager. Then once that is loaded, you want to come over here to live events. Now if you don't see this, you haven't set it up properly, so I'm going to go back to step one and do that again. Now, first step to do this, you're going to want to download this Wirecast. So just click get it now for Mac. It'll just take you to the download and just install it, but I've already got it installed just down there. So next step is you want to create a new event. Now I'll just do one quickly. We'll just put in random things. Okay, so we'll just change private setting to public. Uh, pick category. Do a few tags. And just pick out your time zone because I'm not too sure. I know you can start early, but it just notifies everyone. Okay, now that all change has been made, now it comes up with this screen where you can pick your thumbnail. Now this, um, you have the option to use the Wirecast for YouTube program, uh, Flash Media Live Encoder, or other encoders. Okay, so now that you've got um, Wirecast open, you want to follow these steps here. Now I'll just show them in the video now. Now basically, but first you want to go up here. Now it's not going to be logged in if this is the first time using it. So you have to be signed out and you press sign in, put in your email and your password. Now once that's done, have your email there. Now next step is you want to connect to YouTube. Now this is where you're going to have to make the event. You can't just go stream straight away. Uh, you have to do the event first. So as you can see, it's connected to the event. OK, 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 today at 1.20 p.m. Um, you can only stream at 360p at the moment. And I'll just leave the primary server as it is at the moment. Now what you want to do now is you want to go start streaming. Now we are now live, I believe. So I'll just put up a, something I have on my computer. We'll just play that one. Now if all goes well, that should actually be playing on the my channel streaming. So we'll just go have a look at that. Now before you do do that, you can see it, but before you do that you want to go into this live control room and you press start streaming, but I suggest you test the stream first before you start streaming to see if it's actually working. So just click start streaming. Now we'll go to we'll go to a live event to test the event and then we can see now it's live. So we'll just take a look at this. Now this should be working. Yeah, as you can see there, it's playing the video that I recorded. So anyway guys, uh, that's how to set up and broadcast using the new YouTube streaming service. So anyway guys, if you like this video, don't forget to smack that like button. Also hit that subscribe button down below if you like gaming app reviews, product reviews and all that sort of stuff. So anyway guys, uh, see you later. Bye. Guys, one last thing before I do go. If you're going to be streaming anything, um, I suggest you, that when you finish the stream, you want to go back into your live events and you want to go to the live control room and you want to go to stop streaming. Now this is going to stop the stream. If you don't, it's just going to keep going and going and going um, and you won't be able to stop unless you go on here. So anyway guys, uh, talk to you later. Bye.